Is the cavity ready for insertion? Uh, it is not. It'll be five seconds until it's ready for insertion. You're good. Thank you, sir. Hey! Oh no, it's taking. <laughs> they, we didn't put his lungs back in, though. They they took him without his lungs. Hey, you know what they say about that? Take one of those. Call me in the morning. <laughs> So wait, let's wait till the ghost. Oh, okay, okay, I'm, I'm going back in. Oh, there's two ghosts. Okay, I'm going. Oh, fuck. No, it's all you, baby. Okay, I'm just gonna. Ah! <laughs> That's my bad. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Cool. Okay. And uh, then I'm I'll, gonna as need. As soon you... as you pull it out, I'm gonna stick him. Yeah. Some great insertion. He's, he's, he's running it. He's about half bled out already. Okay. Let's say you got about 100 seconds before things get very real. Okay, he's got it. Okay. There's the bad one. I'm putting it in the bucket. Okay, we seem to be lacking a a good heart. Yeah, yeah. You you work on that for a second. I got a, okay. I got a certain situation going on over here that... It's it's not beyond my abilities. Like I, it shouldn't be too hard to just like sort it out. But just what's going on over there? Oh, All right, not, nothing, nothing. I was just making sure that he was good to go. Okay. And whatever your chat told you just happened, they're they're just lying for attention. Okay. Oh, hey. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you think that Jeff Bezos like? kidnapped Santa and he's got him locked up in his basement and he got him to tell him like all his secrets for like overnight delivery. <laughs> what do you think dude that was, that's a great theory. <laughs> Jeff Jeff Bezos is he went to the North Pole and he was like nice operation Santa. What if you did it 365 days a year <laughs> instead of just one? Good. Don't worry Santa, we'll give you some audible credits. <laughs> Fun? Yeah, no I understand. Um, if they could also like, oh no. <laughs> um, yeah, use a rope. Use a rope. Get. If they could. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh All right, all right, all right. So you you, you ready? <laughs> so I'll I'll do left. You do right. Okay. Hold on, let me grab the rotator cuff. I'm not ready yet either. Not ready yet. Hey, look at me when you do it, please. Well, if, as soon as I look at you, I'm pretty sure it's gonna rip his arm out of his socket. So no, just nice, nice and slow. I, I need to, I need to know you have the confidence to do this. Okay, uh, I'm looking ready? at you. You ready? Okay. Yep. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> rush it, rush it, rush it. Okay. I got the left. Oh, we, I didn't, I didn't bring it with me. I didn't bring it with me. Yep, that makes sense. <laughs> Oh. Chad, I'm not crying. <laughs> I just my, I got something in my eye. Uh, here's a story for you. In like third grade, we went and we saw a local production of Snow White uh, as a field trip for our class. And then like when she eats the uh, apple that makes her fall asleep, I was like, yo, check this out. I went to my friend and I fake cried. Like I summoned all of my acting skill and was oh, like... Shit. You know, oh, it's so sad. And I was like, I had real tears coming out of my yeah. face. And that son of a bitch turned to like everybody in the row and was like, check it out, Ryan's crying. And then I had to be like, it was fake. I was fake crying. And everyone was like, like yeah, fire, sure. <laughs> Made fun of me for like, you know, the whole day for it. Yeah. For the rest of his life. <laughs> That's a long time when you're in third grade. What did I expect? I expected that they would. Well, I mean, oh, dude, I haven't played this. You know, you're eight. What is this? <laughs> you don't know what, what's gonna happen, but huh. uh, I expected that they'd be like, "Whoa, this guy's a great actor." <laughs> <laughs> but they, did, they didn't pick up on that element of it at all. Oh yeah, you're too, like I've been molded by the fires of League of Legends <laughs> over the years, and let me tell you the insults. So I used to call people nerds like eight years ago. Right, and I, I got chat banned. You got chat banned for calling people nerds? Yeah, because people get mad and they'd be like, I'm not a nerd. And I was like, never said there's anything wrong with that. <laughs> and then they'd get really mad and they'd, <laughs> they'd just report you. But then I swapped it up. I started getting uh, creative. Right, so I'd be yeah. like, oh, this guy pulls his pants down to his ankles at the urinal. Okay. Or I'd the... be like, <laughs> this guy opens bags of chips with scissors. <laughs> uh, and then 
<laughs> I'm trying to think. I uh, had a uh, takes 40 items into the 15 item or less lane, and that's how you knew they were a kid. Because I'd be like, oh, they take like 40 items into the 15 item or less lane. And they'd be like, what's that mean? I'm like, oh, they're like 12. <laughs> <laughs> but then you get some people that you're like, oh, uh, actually, it's 15 items or fewer. And then you could hit them with this guy definitely pulls his pants all the way down when he goes to the urinal. <laughs> exactly. Now you're getting it. <laughs> it's yeah, it's it's behind the shop. Oh, dude, um, I'll, I'll cook it. It's no problem. Sure? I got, I got, I got, I got, I got more bombs. Yeah, no, it's easy, man. Get ready for this. Oh, he's already doing it. Okay. Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry. At least there was a reason for that. Oh. <laughs> All right. Sorry, predictors. Sorry, predictors. Okay. No, that. I'm. By the way, I'm with Mouth. Or sorry, I'm with Josh. I think being a podiatrist is the dream. Is that the podiatrist is a bone that, doctor? No, it's sure a foot that? doctor. Oh, no, I no, no, I don't want to be a foot dog. Oh, you like okay. feet? No, just well, you don't. Like, you don't you like feet? No, no, no. I refuse to. Let to everyone shut up for a second because this I'm reflects. Saying, like, you can tell us. It reflects more, more on you than it does for me. The fact that you believe every doctor gets into the medical field because of their fetish scares the crap out of me and really makes me wonder what the American medical system has wrong with it that I'd never considered before. Yeah, but there's a colleges, though, right? Like, you're not fooling anybody. I'm talking about you. You know, in real life, you could read a book multiple times. Yeah, also, you know, in real life, uh, there's no zombies. <laughs> Except for uh, all the millennials who are on their phones all the time, if you know what I mean. Instead of looking out the window like a like a true intellectual. I got a new new comedy special coming to Netflix this September. It's called, it's Ryan Letourneau. It's called Kids These Days. I'll give you a little preview of the first joke that I've got in the special. Yeah. Hey, you know, I don't get what's up with the kids these days. They're always on their cell phones. Back when I was a kid, my dad hit me. All right. <laughs> just, just do it. Just, just let yeah, me yeah, see yeah, what yeah. it's like. Let me see what it's like. Yeah, me. No! <laughs> it's beautiful. Look, go in here with me. Ryan. Do you want me to go in, or do you want me to save the achievement for you guys later? You should save no, I don't it. Give it. No, Yo, especially if give you... you the achievement, Ryan. Yeah, you should save it. Especially if you can't, if you can't bring us back. Then no. we should try to get there all all alive. I think if you left the mission, then Ryan, then Malv can go in there, and then I can get the achievement and be like, I'm the. Here, best let's play blunder. a game. The first one of you to actually freeze me wins. <gasps> no, quit! <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, L, O, F, four, O, F, four, buddy. Play, play stupid games, win uh, stupid prizes. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. I mean, who could have predicted that it could have happened after <laughs> after you asked if I wanted to. <laughs> go in and then I said no and then you d just did it anyway. Oh, you're fine. <laughs>